Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Siblings react and drink. Woo. My name is Rick. This is my lovely sister. Janice. And today we're bringing you... Band of Brothers. We're continuing. Band of Brothers, episode 6. Bastogne. Or if you want to say it in French, Bastogne. Uh, French I gave it like an Italian... French man Bastogne. major here. How is it in French? Bastogne. Okay. But I'm probably not, pro not pronouncing it 100%, but it's the, the G and E is like an Enya, like Well, Bastogne. she's pronouncing it, the Belgium town, she's pronouncing it in French. When we're drinking California wine <laughs> mixed with uh, port. port wine from Portugal. Mm -hmm. And something else, some so spices, like, some cinnamon, some good stuff on here. Some Very other good. fruits. Yeah. It's called a winter wine. Mm-hmm. It's got like a really good flavor, right? It is awesome. I love it. I Very like sweet good. wines. Yeah, me too. Unfortunately for me. So anyway, the Germans pulled a fast one. They cut through the forest where everyone thought uh, the mountains there. Everyone thought that it was impenetrable. He mm -hmm. did it. I think a couple of Panzer divisions and I don't know how many more. Mm. Anyway, bad news for the Allies. We saw them that they're headed that way, but they're not ready because it was like December and they thought they weren't going to fight until March. Mm -hmm. So they don't have it, winter clothing, they don't have ammunition, they don't have food. Yeah, that's crazy, man. They got a, looks like a so-so uh, lieutenant in mm -hmm. charge of Easy Company right now, mm -hmm. which Winters had to tell him what to do instead of him figure, you know, figuring right. out what to do mm -hmm. but don't worry Jimmy Fallon showed up <laughs> with, uh, with a jeep full of uh, supplies yeah ammunition I think it was mm -hmm. so he's on the case that was good he saved the day in a way he said he would try to make another trip but who knows because these guys are headed we saw the other the other army uh, it got beat up another company mm -hmm. I guess they were they got cut by surprise also and they got their asses kicked so now the easy company from the 101st airborne division are on their way so we'll see what happens all right you ready let's do it we didn't have enough ammunition we didn't have enough war wow no ammunition whatever we needed and there was a what's the story of the army man well i can buy a stone we're down around one round per man there for a while wow one bullet per man wow we go to bed and uh, my wife will tell you that the first thing I'll say is I'm glad I'm not. Oh, man. I don't know, man. I don't like cold. Even though I live in a cold uh, climate. Yeah, I don't but, like it either. But being with no proper... Right, that's worse. Hmm. Imagine leaving your house right now without a coat and it's cold yeah. out. Yeah. Oh, you're going to feel it. You have to sleep outside? I decided to record this episode instead of uh, dinner. So this is my dinner right here. <laughs> Some trail mix. Oh, what is this? Yeah, it's like a trail mix. Something it's a very like good one. Spicy. It is. Yeah, it's really good. So, sorry if you hear me chewing. What happened? Oh. The Germans? They froze. Maybe they froze they're to death in their sleep. Hmm? Yeah, they're frozen. Wow. I think you wander off a little bit too far. How terrible. You decided to but go for a walk. You said those were Germans that I were there? I think so. Oh. I don't know. Because these guys don't have uh, coats. Those guys had like uh, long coats and stuff. So I assume they were German. That oh, that's taking good. a dump. Yeah. <laughs> wow. You wander too far from camp too. Middle of the day. All right. <laughs> Uh, what about an extra thread in your eight kilo? How'd you morphing, guy? Holy fuck! <laughs> Soldiers are giving up their own kits to to the yeah. doctor so he can use them whoever needs it. Right. These foxholes are not very deep, man. No. You call these foxholes? Yeah. Italian. No. Oh. Oh, shit. German foxhole. Oh man. Scheiße! Oh! Come on, speed, move! 
Oh my god. Hey, listen, I need to know whether you kept your morphine from Holland. No, you asked me already, remember? Yeah, this guy keeps asking the same questions. That's not a good thing. Yeah, I mean... That's that's what I was saying. Like, he he, he keeps asking the same thing, you know. Hasn't slept, hasn't eaten, hasn't... Mm. Go on, you want me? Oh, yeah, uh, morphine. Slurp between pwned up the contraband. All right. Thanks. He can get shot too going into Foxhole to a Foxhole, you know? Right. Somebody to jump in. Oh, yeah. Mm. He found scissors, he found morphine. Oh, morphine. Mm hmm. Ah! Oh, shit. Jeep. Oh, come on, Doc. That's what did to my leg. Easy CP. Oh, my God. This shit has been hit. Oh, oh man. Well, I thought there was bones sticking out. It's like mm. pieces of wood, right? Yeah. Save the morphine. I can make it. I can make it save them. Man, fuck, man. Wow. Is this true? I mean, th these guys were tough, man. <laughs> I mean, consider it. What choice did they have? You know, you're out there. You gotta survive somehow. Oh my I'm real sorry, I don't know if it's for the movie. I heard stories where people were used to stabbing themselves just so they can get out of the front line. Mm. I mean, whatever the case, it's just we're lucky that there's people out there doing all that stuff, you know? I know in World War One they were, because he was in the trenches, it was so bad. Not to fight him, but just the boredom, whatever. People were sleeping with hookers just so they can get VD, so they can mm. be taken off the front line. Wow. Ah. Uh, any, you know, because you're sick, they bring you back, but... Yeah. But here there is no aid station, like they said. Wow. So... They're giving the boys food for the pain! Ah! The poor guy. They're giving them booze for the pain. You got plasma? Wait, please. Mm. Okay, I thought I saw a bone sticking out. I guess not. Mm. They look like it. Yeah. It's a piece of wood or... Mm. Uh, from the bed. What, sheets? Yes, the bandages. Where? Where just now? Mm-hmm. Well? Merci. He got some, you know, some stuff. Comment vous appelez-vous? My name is René. I'm Jean. Eugene Rose. Hey. It's always time for flirting. From? <laughs> Louisiana. Half Cajun. Oh, Louisiana. That's why he speaks French. That was nice. He found boots for what's his name? He found boots, he found supplies. And chocolate. And a beautiful morning smile. Yeah. It's a good, it's a good morning so far. Fight well for your God and your country. God bless you all. Okay, we have the chaplain pay them a visit. That's it, guys. Nothing more to worry about. Give them holy communion. Oh, get down, you idiot! Oh shit! I knew something was gonna happen. When yeah. You, when you the said rookie it's, trying to volunteer for shit. When you said he's having a good day, I'm like, that's it. He's done. Oh no, he's here. I thought. So who got shot? I thought it was him. No, he. They told him to stay. The oh. new guy. They wanted to go first. Mm. He froze. We gotta hit the deck the second you hear a shot. Wow. Oh, fuck, in the throat. Yeah, he got shot like right. Who the hell was that? I don't know. He called him sir, so is that the freaking lieutenant running away? Somebody's got to tell him what to do. Maybe he's imagining the whole thing. He said we're pulling back, but I don't think he ever gave the order. These guys are determining they got to go back. So one dead, one wounded, or two dead? They're probably be crawling everywhere. That little part looks like fake snow. Look more like powder than snow. Yeah, yeah it did. But right. who knows? Reminded me of the vignettes yeah. we had in New Orleans. Yeah. I would never stand up like that. I'd probably be crawling everywhere mm. for fear. Supplies?
No, they're marking the ter They're marking so the planes can. Uh, these are not supply planes. Oh, okay, shit. get out of the way, moron. Holes, holes. And planes don't know. They can't tell who's who. Sergeant, I don't understand. It was the wrong planes. Yeah. Okay, they're the bombers or supplies. Bring supplies. It's dropped. It's dropped. Come on. Good. Yeah, that's good. They all need it. Yeah, go get that one up there. <laughs> Be careful though, because if the if the chute doesn't open, pff, you know, oh, yeah, it's gonna kill people. Okay. Uh, the plane doesn't know. They thought it was Germans trying to get the supplies. You know. Right. That's what I mean. Like a lot of times, like you don't even know who's on your side. That's crazy. A, no, I had a friend, uh, and coworker. Uh, he w he was in Vietnam, mm. and he says that he doesn't have any nightmares. He doesn't have any problems. Except when he hears a helicopter. Ooh. Scares the living crap out of him. I can't even imagine. Because a lot of times the our own you know, their own helicopters were shooting on them. Yeah. Yeah. That's their crazy. own patrol, whatever, and they had to take over because helicopters should we they thought they were the enemy. Right. So he could be at the park with his family, he hears a helicopter. Yeah. He, he panics. That's messed up, man. Even with supplies, they can help everyone, you know? Right. Anna's like, looks like you guys are having a romantic moment. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I'm out of here. Better than here, oh, that's for shit, sure. Oh, shit, somebody's behind them. Hey, it's oh, my God. We shouldn't sneak up on people. They could kill them. Yeah. What happened to the flash thunder thing? Right. Or the little... T -t 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 the little clicker, clicker thing. Yeah. Man, of all the dead people you saw there, you couldn't grab all their jackets. Maybe you can double put double jacket instead of... That's true, right? There were a lot of dead bodies there. He took some boots from somebody. Right. What the hell is that noise? Oh, Thanks. man. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Oh, oh my God. Goes. Double whammer. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Time to work. Man. I got it. I'm keeping it for you. Smoke. I got my legs, G. Oh, man. Oh, he got hit in the spine or something. Machine guns, open fire. You got the odor. Open fire, machine guns. He's so many. He's like all over the place. Right. Oh, my God. Hey, hey, come on, Walter. Stop. If he's dead, don't give him plasma. Right. Oh, he's still there. Look at all the jackets there. Unless they don't have jackets anymore, but I don't know. Paralyzed. What? He's paralyzed. He can't feel anything, so there's no need for morphine. Right. <laughs> Fuck. And being privileged to take part in this gallant feat of arms. We're truly making for ourselves. Merry Christmas. I read that in the history books. That was the reply, like, nuts. Like, are you nuts? Mm. We're not surrendering. Mm. <laughs> nuts. Because <laughs> they were, basically, they were surrendered. You yeah. Know, they wouldn't surrender. They were surrounded by, by them. Yeah. Well, this looks a little deeper. Yeah. Incredible, man. One guy gets shot and hey, I'm not leaving. I'm not getting off the line. <laughs> yeah. Oh, what's this? Oh, the doctor finally fell asleep. Well, he slept with the other two guys, right? So he did. Yeah. He got a couple of hours at least. The Germans are seeing. They're seeing Silent Night. It's Christmas. Got to thank jolly old St. Louis. Oh. Oh. You remember they used to have chocolate cigarettes? Those little, like, remember those? Like for to Like eat? just for candy. Oh, yeah, yeah, to yeah, eat. yeah. Like just uh, cigarettes, but made out of chocolate. Yeah. Or some they were bubblegum, too, I think. Bubblegum, too, yeah. But I like the chocolate ones. Dancing. Oh, there you go, buddy. There you go. What are you talking Frank, about? What? You would never write a Dear John letter, is what you what you tell me? Every letter you write would be Dear John. <laughs> <laughs> 
I did smell a fire. Are you out of your mind? <laughs> You're out of your mind? <laughs> oh. Huh? Wow, we're gonna get hit. Ah, uh, shit. Great. Oh, he landed on the fire? Yeah. Oh my god. Did it burn or he got shot? Or both? I can't tell. He got hit. The doc doesn't want to. The medics. He's done. Medics out golfing. And these are all the, these are all the senior officers, yeah. man. Get down. get down, dude. You're gonna get shot. Oh, oh he's like making me nervous. Shot on the leg. Oh, mm. He got burned, right? He fell. On no, the I think or he, he was shot. like the. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, this shot. is one of the lieutenants, too, or probably captain by now. Who knows? Mm. Yeah, he's doing anyone any good. Right. Oh shit, so these are German planes? Yeah, because the Americans are shooting up. So these are American planes. I mean, German planes. That's not good. Oh, they're bombing. Wow. They're bombing the town. Where the hospital is. Well, what a time to go have a hot meal up in town. Oh, did the hospital get hit? The church? Oh, fuck, look at this. Wow. Mm. Yeah, the hospital's gonna be hit, I'm sure. They're incendiary bombs. They're meant to burn. Oh, man, don't tell me that. His girlfriend. Oh, man. Was that her? Yeah, that was hers. Her head, the band, or mm -hmm. what do you call it? Head, uh... Like her bandana or whatever. Wow. Mm. It was better off here. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Here we go. I mean, I hope she, he didn't see her, right? Or was she there? I don't know if he took care of her head or he found it on the floor. I don't know. It seemed like he found it on the floor, but... Yeah. Call me babe. Yeah, I was like, why did he call her babe? I thought it was a nickname. Just now. <laughs> he never calls people with a nickname until now. <sighs> babe. That's on. That's a goddamn right. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I hope she just dropped it and that she's, you know, was yeah. able to get away. It looked like he stopped and he was staring. Yeah, we didn't specify whether she was under that. It could be either. It could go either way, really. <sighs> she would have been there, like, trying to help people and then, like, you know, everything fell on her. So messed up. Mm. Yeah, I wish they would have let us know. Maybe or they, not. Maybe they will in the nah, future. Nah, maybe it's good. She's alive. Okay, what's to say there? Can you read it? On December 26, 1944, General Patton's 3rd Army broke through the German lines, allowing supplies to flow in and the wounded to be evacuated. Oh, that's good. Yeah. The story of the Battle of the Bulge, as told today, is one of Patton coming to the rescue of the <laughs> encircled 101st Airborne. Of course. Yeah. Surprised they <laughs> the Battle of the Bulge. It. Yeah. Patton was a big shot, you know, during, uh, he fought in Africa and he fought mm -hmm. in, in Italy. And there was an incident with a soldier that was suffering from PTSD. Mm -hmm. And he goes, what's wrong with you, soldier? How come you're here in, in the hospital? And the guy said, I don't know, like, I just can't. So he slapped him. You freaking coward. You're supposed wow. to be in the front line. What are you doing? There's real people, hospitals for wounded people. Not for, her. but you know they didn't understand that. But anyway, it was, he did it in front of photographers, it, and yeah. and news reporters. So basically, he, 
he got sent back. He lost his position. But the Germans were so scared of him that they put him in charge of a fake base in England. So when they did the did they happen, the Germans didn't think that was a real attack because they thought Patton's the one that's going to lead the attack. Mm. And Patton's still at the base. <laughs> it was a fake base with cardboard tanks, cardboard soldiers, cardboard everything. Mm -hmm. And uh, supposedly he was in charge of that. Wow. But it's not until he asked uh, General Bradley to, hey man, talk to, what's his name, uh, Eisenhower. Mm. I want to go back and put me back in the war before the war's over. So that, you know, because he was in charge of the tanks, mm -hmm. the Third Army. It was a yeah. tank uh, tank division, and he came to the rescue. So that's that history lesson. Mm. Yep. Hope I got it right. No members of the 101st has ever agreed that the division needed to be rescued. <laughs> didn't I say that? Mm. I'm surprised they acknowledged it. I guess yeah. they didn't. We were doing just fine in that winter resort. Mm. Well, the guy at the beginning, he said that they were down to like one bullet a person. Oh, man. Well, so that's the end of episode now six. I'm going to be thinking about Rene. What's it called? Basque. Bags. Bastone. No, in Bast French. Bastonia. Bastonia. Okay, mm -hmm. perfect. I hope Rene's alive somewhere. Well, they didn't show out. it to us, so I'm assuming she's alive. Mm. Maybe we'll see her again in a future episode. She just lost her... You never know. ...bandana while she was running out of there with three soldiers in her. <laughs> yeah. Carrying three soldiers. Man. Or dragging three guys. Whatever. I hope she made it. Yeah. Uh, but, man, that was crazy. Yeah. Miracle anyone made it Sad. out alive. Right. Anyway, guys, uh, we're going to call it a night. Uh, hope you like this reaction. Uh, like, 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 like the video. And subscribe. Let the algorithm know this video is good. Share, like, subscribe. Let us know in the comments uh, what your thoughts are, or if any of you have any stories like this. Or correct me in my whatever I said about the little history thing I said. If I'm wrong, if I'm right, or add to it. Appreciate that. Yep. And. See you on the next one. Later. Bye.